Okay, um, so in this video, what I want to show you how to do is I want to show you how to research products. And um, this is going to be the most important part of any type of e-commerce business, is, um, especially the dropshipping business, is it's very, very important to find products that are already winning, you know, products that we basically know that people are actually after. And um, this process right here will, like, you know, give me, it'll give me a, a good sense of what's, you know, what's really hot right now. So um, that's what I really want to help you with um, in this particular video. So I want to show you how to look for products that are already hot and um, it kind of gives us an idea of what to sell and what not to sell. So uh, one of the sites that I use that I really like is called watchcount.com. And what this does is it kind of shows me what's most popular on eBay but based on what people are watching and what people are buying. So, um, you know, eBay is, is basically an e-commerce platform. So if it's doing well on eBay, it's pretty much going to do well when we advertise it on Facebook through Shopify, the Shopify platform. So I want to give you an example. Let's say I wanted to um, research Batman, which is one of my favorite niches. I type in Batman. Um, let's wait for this to load up. Uh, yes, I'll type in Batman. Come on, come on, come on. My computer's moving a little bit slow today, so please just bear with me. Um, so basically, what comes up first is basically the, the items with the most sales. And um, this is actually a product that I sold in the past, but um, what I learned about Facebook is that they don't like when you actually promote weapons. But um, it was a pretty successful product until like you know Facebook banned one of my ads that um, had this, and because they, they said that they don't like the promotion of weapons, so I had to take that um, that post down. But um, there's other products here that you know that sell really well that I've tried out. You know, it kind of gives me the idea of what's hot and you know what people are actually after. Like for instance, this um, cell phone case has 369 people watching it, and um, is almost like you know 800, almost 900 sales. So this is a product that I would want to test. You know, it's a product that you know is going to be might be successful. Um, there's other things here that you know that might be high sellers like this toy right here. I see that it has, I see that it has 346 watchers, and it has 283 sales. So I think that this is a product that um, will also do well. So basically, this is what I use, like you know, to find out what's hot on eBay. And chances are, if it's really hot on eBay, it's going to be really hot when we actually want to sell it through our store. And it has tons of products you know, that, uh, it, that basically, like, you know, we can test out and see if it works, if it work on the site. Um, so as we continue, uh, I'm going to give you an example of what I would do typically, like, during my research project um, process. And I'm also going to show you other sites that I use, too, as well. This is not the only one, but this is one of my favorites because it tells me, it gives me a good idea of what's going to, what's hot on, on eBay at the current moment and usually what's hot on eBay as I said it's going to translate to what's hot you know for Shopify and the platform all right so as we continue I'm going to show you what we do so I'm going to give you an example um, I'm actually this is this is actually what I'm doing right now I'm doing a research right now so I want to take you through like a typical day of what I'll do so um, I'm really liking this product right here um, it has 254 watchers and it has over 1,000 sales. So this kind of gives me a good idea of what's hot right now um, in the Batman niche. So what I'll do is I'm going to open this up. All right. And it's kind of like a Batman logo set. Um, This looks like a pretty good product, as I said. Um, I can tell that it's pretty hot by the amount of watchers and um, and the sales that it has. So what I'll do is I'm basically going to start. I would sell this product, and it's very very easy to actually start selling this product. I'm going to show you how to do it. So um, what I'll do is uh, first I'll take all the information from this from this particular um, product. So this is called one second. Why are you giving me such a hard time? Okay, just bear with me for a second. 
this being a pain. Okay, so what I'll do is this is called the Batman Joker lot. Alright, so I'd say I'll do I'll go to products. Moving a little bit slow. I'm not sure why it's moving so slow today. Um, just bear with me for a second. I'm sorry about this. My computer's moving a little bit slower than usual. Um, so I go to products, then I go to add product. Just give it a little second to load up. I think it's moving a little bit slow today because I'm use, using the screen share. For some reason, every time I use it, um, my computer moves, moves a little bit slower than usual. So basically, um, I, go to, I go to products. I go to add. I'll do it one more time. I go to products. Click that. And then I'll go to add product. And by doing this, what it basically does is um, it allows me to put something new in my store. Um, the video that I, I sent you, um, I think it, it should have went through this, but um, I'm just going through it one more time as a review. So um, basically, I'll put Batman, Lego, 8, 8, piece, set. And um, what I'll do is I'll actually copy this picture. Um, let me see if I can copy it from here. So basically, as you see, is basically I'm just I'm finding out what's hot. Um, I'm going to the, the the place where they sell it, and I'm copying and pasting the information. It's that simple. So I copy this image. No, save image. Excuse me. I'll save image. Save. Um, so I like to save the image in desktop. So um, I'll call it Batman Lego Set. Batman Lego Set One. All right, so that's one picture, and I'm just gonna copy and paste basically all the pictures that he has here. It's that easy. Save image as. So I'm gonna go back to my desktop, and it's gonna be Batman. Lego set two. Save image as desktop. All right, desktop. Batman Lego set three. And of course, I'll just go through the whole process, you know, but I don't want to do all of them right here. So, what I'll do is I'm going to copy all the images. And upload the image here. It's that simple. Um, I go back to my desktop, and I'll just put in the information. Batman. We'll look for it. Um, let's see here. Uh, yeah. So I'll just take the inf I'll take the picture. i um, upload it here. Um, you know, I'm just gonna do you know two for the purpose of, of demonstration. So I'll put that there. Actually, let's put this one here, and I'll basically type in the information. So I'll go to, excuse me, where are you? All right, X this out, and um, I'll go to the information. Let's see where we find the information. So basically, the description is here. Um, I won't copy the pictures because the picture is up above. So I'll just take the same information. Copy and paste it. All right, go back to my store. Paste the information here. Um, I have it set up here in my store for, um, I put it under the Batman collection. Um, for this particular product, I'll probably sell it for. Um, I say about fourteen ninety nine. For here, it's um. Here it's the price is 
three forty nine. So I can sell it anywhere from um you know ten dollars to about fifty dollars and make a nice little profit on it. And um I can I'll compare it at a higher price here for twenty nine ninety nine. Ooh, ooh, oopsie, oopsie, twenty nine ninety nine. Um, I put things. I don't charge taxes, and I put things basically for free, free shipping. And basically, I'll save the product. And um. Basically, that product is now in my store now, and it's ready for it's ready for sale. So, I'll go to um I'll go to view, and this will actually give me the. This is basically is how it's gonna look in my store. So um as you see here, everything is um is set up. See, it has the um the price, it has the description here, and you know basically here, it has the picture. So. It's simple. Basically, what I'll do is um, after this, I'll basically do an ad on Facebook, which I'll go through in, in another video. But um, I just want to basically show you the whole research process of like, you know, what we do. And it's basically I find products that are hot using watchcop.com. And in another video, I'm going to show you the other places that I use. But I have to keep this down to 15 minutes in this video. But um, basically what I'll do, I go to watchcount.com. Um, which is this website? It'll tell me basically what's hot, what's the hottest products on eBay at the moment. Um, I go to the particular page where that item is. I copy and paste all the information. Um, I put it into my store. And um, basically, when someone purchases this particular product, all I do is I go to eBay, I buy this product, I put it, I put their address in, like you know when I make the order, and this vendor will deliver to the person, and it's that simple. Um, and this is this is the basic process of drop shipping. So um, is that you know this is one example. I wanted to show you one place, one of my one of my favorite places to actually, you know, to actually look for hot products. So it makes everything so simple because I don't have to like spell and guess what product might be hot or like you know waste a lot of money on things that are not likely to produce sales. This actually this is beautiful. This actually tells me what is already selling. <laughs> you know it tells me what's hot already so all I have to do is basically look what's hot look what product is it's is selling um, go to the, the page copy and paste it and basically um, put it in my store and order from them and they'll basically drop ship it to whichever customer so you know that's a beautiful process and um, you know this is just one thing that I'll, that I'll do this is one example I'm going to show you other sites that I use so um, as I said you look for this information over here if you see over I say if you see over 250 watchers, that means the product is pretty hot, and you see like, you know, anywhere from 300 to 1,000 sales. That pretty much gives you a good idea that it's going to be a hot product, and this is probably a product that you should sell. All right, so it's that simple. It's um, it's basically finding what product is selling, and advertising the the, the product. That's basically that simple, and put it into your store. Um, with this business, you don't have to have any type of inventory. You don't have to like hold on to stuff. You, it's basically made to order. So when somebody orders something, you just ship it to them and they get it. And you don't have to worry about any of you know holding stuff and you know things like of that nature. So um, this is the first video. This is basically as I said, um, using watch counts to find what product is hot. In the next video, I'm going to show you how to use another site called Winello, and that basically will give me an idea of what's also hot on um you know what's also more likely to produce sales. All right. So in the next video, I'm gonna go through Winello Winello.com. Okay, thank you.